was over, they thought I was finished, dawg Whole city jump behind me, now I get more racks than a tennis ball And you know ain't no looking back, the streets brought the hustle out of me I was sick of eating part of me, ramen noodles all through the week The struggle was ugly, made something out What it do, what it do, man Seven eight Chevy boy Right here in Big Zeus this morning, man Cause we just left the gym Then I come outside, man, big homie out here waiting on me Big bro Ty in that clean 77 Regal. Yeah, man. He got it out. And it's raining out here, man. So you already know, it gotta be some serious if we out here in the rain with this thing, man. But uh, just stay tuned. Just stay tuned. About to get some upgrades, man. Well, we about to get a upgrade right now. Y'all stay tuned to see where we about to take it, man. Gonna go drop it off. So you know it gotta be some major, man, if we, uh, if we out here in the rain. Cause you know, we don't bring them things out in the rain, man, unless it's, unless it's a necessity. So let's get to it. 78 Chevy, boy, keep it locked, man. And this is one of the cars that will be at the Connect and Never Competing Car Show, man. It will be there. So if you want to check out this clean Regal, make sure you're there, man. It'll be one of many that'll be at the car show. Keep it locked. All right. <laughs> Y'all see him? <laughs> Yo, I told him, Ty, we don't bring them out in the rain unless it's a necessity. Yes, hey, hey, you know it's real serious. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right. All right. What a thing clean, boy. Slide them things on the slab, man. We ride them, we do not hide them. You already know what's up with me and my people, man. Me and my people, we ride them, man. But uh, why we on the why we on this uh on this little quick little mission? I might as well talk about something that I wanted to talk about. I don't know if I was on Instagram live. Yeah, I think I was on Instagram live. And I wanted to talk about it, man. Uh, just accountability, man. I want to talk about accountability. It don't matter what business you in you know I'm a, I'm a barber photographer youtuber man but I deal with all sorts of people you know we deal we come in contact we do business with people every day some type of way man and, and, and with that being said uh, it's up to that business owner to make sure the client is satisfied man I'm talking about and, and, and right now I'm talking about the car the car culture whether it's a painter a uh, uh, mobile, I mean, an uh, uh, audio installer, a uh, uh, LS swap man, a uh, suspension man. It don't matter who you are. You got to make sure the client is happy, man. And uh, and don't be don't be getting over trying to get over on people. When I say that, you know, people be people be taking deposits in, uh, pushing people back. 
throwing them on the back burner because I'm going to tell you where it come from. Nine times out of ten, when I hear a person say they car been at a shop for so long, dude ain't touched it, uh, 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 he ain't heard from him, he ain't give him no updates, nothing like that. Nine times out of ten, because I've dealt with it from experience, you done gave that man some money. You done gave him some money to get started, or not, or uh, uh, ten times out of ten, you done gave him all the money. When you give him all the money, oh, sh you you finna have some goddamn trouble, man. You finna have some trouble. So there there it goes when they say the little saying, uh, robbing Peter to pay Paul. There it is right there. You robbing Peter to pay Paul, man. They take your money. The deposit they you giving them it's the same thing they did with the person before you so the money that they take from you they may be finna spend that money on, on one of them, them previous projects and if i'm lying correct me i'm just saying i'm talking about for the for the for the bull crap uh businessman i ain't talking about the businessman that handle their business because because I'm, I'm gonna give you one for example like ty down at eminent automotive I ain't Ty don't want no money up front. Ty don't want no money up front unless it's a, it might be a big, big job and uh, you might, you know, give him the money to start, get the supplies or something, but but more than likely, Ty don't even want no money. He want his money on the back end, man. They'll let you know that man ain't finna get in there, get it done, and get you up out of there, man. Pretty much. Hold on, man. What, what this guy here got going on? He driving slow, man. Yeah, with the 250. Trying to make it happen. Boy, you got plastic and tan all off that junk. That ain't even a 250. That's a 150. He pulling it, though. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> back to our, our program. Yeah, man. Uh, So with that being said, man, you going to be held accountable. And it's our fault as the consumer to not put these people on blast, man. Put them people on blast. They got bad business. Cause, cause me, with who, me being who I am, and it's just, it's just, it is what it is, man. I'm an influencer. I can influence somebody to come to your, to, to your establishment, or I can influence somebody not to deal with you at all, and they probably not. If I tell them don't deal with you, it's for a good reason, and. I can say whatever I said to them, I can say it again in your face because I'm telling the truth. I am not a liar, man. I am not a liar. I don't I don't tear people down on purpose. If I'm if I'm saying something negative about you or your establishment, it's because you deserve it. You deserve it, man. If you didn't try to make it right with me, I'm gonna put you on blast, man. It's just simple as that. And that's what all of us need to do. If a person not taking care of their business with you, man. We got all these platforms now. You got Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, Twitter. You got so many platforms you can put a person on blast, man. And you are not in the wrong. Don't make a don't let a, a person make you think you wrong for telling the truth. The truth will never change, man. It'll never change. And so if we start putting people in their place, man, have, holding them accountable, I guarantee they're gonna straighten up or or, or their business gonna fade away. You see what I'm saying? It's about reviews. If you look online on the restaurant, you Google a restaurant and look up under there. It's gonna have reviews on it. So it's our it's our uh responsibility to make them reviews. I don't care what you say, I don't care who it is, I don't care what kind of ties I got with you, man. If you my partner, if I've been if we got long lasting uh business relationship if you do wrong you wrong man whether it's by me or anybody else and i'm gonna call it straight down the middle man so if this if this, if, if you looking at this video and you feel some type of way or 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 something like that it's probably because you're guilty you, you probably be guilty man so all i ask you to do is straighten it up especially if i deal with you or i got any kind of ties to you man straighten it up man because because if i send somebody to you it's off the business that me and you done, right? And they're going to believe everything I say. And which, if I tell them to go to you, everything I said is true. But soon as they get to you, you do them wrong. 
So man, that's like that's like a slap in the face to me, man. It's like a slap in the face because I give free advertisement, man, for for a lot of people, a lot of shops, a lot of businesses, man. And I don't ask for nothing in return, man. I don't I don't ask for nothing in return. And uh and the least you can do is take care of people, man. Straighten your business up. That's all I'ma say, man. Straighten your business up. And then when we turn around and, and, and put you on blast, you try to make us out the bad guy. Man, it ain't gonna work with me. It's not gonna work with me. I've been doing it and from now on I will do it. You know what I'm saying? I might not get on here and 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 tell and just blast out. Uh, unless you really like really did me wrong wrong and didn't make it right. But I'm not gonna get on here and be like uh I'm gonna say Ty, cause me and Ty ain't got no problem. I'm just gonna use him for example. Man, Ty ain't man, Ty ain't straight. Don't go to him, man. He ain't gonna handle his business. He ain't gonna do what he's supposed to do. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna get on here and just blast Ty name out, but let somebody ask me about Ty. I'm gonna be like, man, no, nah, I can tell you from my experience, don't fool with him. Don't fool with him. And one thing I'm not gonna ever do is tear down a person or speak negative on a person that I haven't done business with. It be people hitting me up about people here in the city all the time. It be people, you know, from out of town hit me up. They'll hit me up, be like, man, uh, how is what's night? Should I take my car to what's night? I'll be like, man, I don't know. I can't I can't speak on it because I've never done business with them. You know what I'm saying? I can only speak on the guys that I've done business with. So if you're trying to get this, this, this done, take it here, here, here. You know what I'm saying? Take it here, here, here. That's the only thing I'm going to do, man. I ain't going to speak down on another shop if I ain't done business with them. But believe me, if you done bad business with them, I'm going to let them know. Nah, bro. Don't, don't, mm -mm. don't fool with him. So, that's my little uh, ride along talk of the day. We almost down here to our destination, man. We down here in downtown Memphis. We about to pull up at one of the uh, most known shops in the city, man. That's known for quality work, top notch service, man. You cannot beat it. I ain't gonna say one of the best in the city. They the best in the city, man. They the best in the city, and I, I can't even. Uh, and, and you can't argue with that, man. If you if you would like to argue, drop down. I ain't gonna say argue, debate. If you would like to debate, because it's a difference between an argument and a debate. Drop down in the comments, man. Uh oh, I ain't forget no ticket. <laughs> I ain't forget no ticket. But uh, drop down in the comments if you would like to debate, man. That this shop, Dunn's Upholstery is not the best in the city at what they do. I'm telling you, man. And uh, uh I've done I've done work with them several times, man, several times. And they've always treated me right. I ain't got nothing bad to say about them. Uh if they can do it, they're going to do it. If they can't, they ain't. <laughs> and they're going to let you know they can't do it. And uh, and when they do it, they gonna when you leave there, you gonna be satisfied. Don't you know? I hate people that go to a place, they get their car, knowing they see something they don't like, but don't say nothing. You know what I'm saying? And then leave. That's your fault. Don't leave with your vehicle unless you unless you uh unless you uh satisfied, man. Y'all see? Y'all know I gotta get that thumbnail. Y'all know I gotta get that thumbnail. Look how you looking at it. Look how you looking at it. <laughs> Look how you looking at that thing, boy. Give me a minute. We'll be right back, man. Send a Chevy boy. All right. Send a Chevy boy. We down here, man. Yeah. We down here, baby. Down here, Don's up host. Yeah. About to get it in. One thing I need to do, because I know it's going to go dead. I'm going to go swap that battery out right quick, and we'll be right back, man. Give me a minute. What a dude, guys. Damn, I don't know who he blowing at, but man. sound like everybody. <laughs> that man. 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 You said who that pretty? You on the a few minutes ago? Yes, sir. Man. man. <laughs> <laughs> who he does a man? Oh, thank you, man. Appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> you have a D, too. Sir? But you're going to have a D. 
Um, a roof. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Uh, <laughs> I like old school style. Thank you, man. Yeah. Man, I like old school style. <laughs> I was just telling my brother, I said, when I passed you, I said, man, that bitch clean. I said, I ain't the only one out here getting dirty. I said, yeah, I ain't the only one bringing out the dirt. CDL, y'all. But they told me to bring it today. Right. I didn't want to bring out in the rain. I know. I'm going to go home and clean it back up. You ain't the only one. You ain't the only one. We don't want to bring them out in the rain. What you got? I got an 87 Caprice, and I got a 91 short bed truck. Okay. You know what I want? What's that? I want that 69 Roll Rock. Okay. Roll runner. That's what I want. Okay. That's a uh, nice a, one. That's a six seven command. Yeah. yeah. I like old school, man, but they oh, yeah. cost so much money. Yeah, they, they do. Boy, you know, boy. Yeah. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> That's a rolling boy. Man. Yeah. <laughs> What's your name? Ty. Ty, I'm Larry. Nice to meet you, nice Mr. Larry. Meet you. All right. Person, Mr. Larry. Larry. Yeah. Nice to meet y'all. Right. Nice, nice to meet you, too. Nice to meet you, too, man. Y'all take care. All right. You too. Have a good day here. All right. You do the same. All right. Y'all see that, man? Car people just attract car people, man. If you're a car person, you're going to track him, man. That's old school. He just dropped his uh, he dropped his bed off. He got it back in the back. Look like a uh, C6. That thing clean. Ty had just got through talking about it. Uh, he seen it on the expressway. As soon as he come out, he said something about Ty car, man. That's what it's about, man. Connected, never compete, man. Matter of fact, he got his vet over there. I'm going to go get it on camera for y'all, man. I'm going to go get it on camera. You don't mind if I record your car, Mr. Larry? You mind if I record your car? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Okay. <laughs> yeah, C seven. I mean C six. C six. Yeah. Hey, how you doing? What's up? What's up, Nani? Y'all see it? It's all about the car. Strictly Viz. They, you, you with them? With my roof. Yeah. Strictly Viz. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I got a uh, I got a big car show coming up May 15 at the Lander Center. Oh, okay. Uh, down at the Lander Center. Yeah. It's on a Sunday. Oh, uh, I'm gonna be on Le Okay, then May 15. Hey, May, you got a car? May 15. Uh, no, I ain't got no. Nah, I ain't got no okay, and, and I'm in my truck. I ain't, I ain't got no okay. flyers in my truck, but uh, man. May 15 on Sunday. It's on a right, Sunday. Yeah, okay. We'll pull it in right now. Is that all right? Okay, that's okay. fine. All right. Yeah. Hi, If you look up Strictly Vets, Strictly Vets, send to Maurice, he'll give it to all. Okay, because all car club, welcome. You took that picture. That's the name of the club. And Maurice Wood, he's the president. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to take a picture of it right now. I'll do that. Okay. All right, y'all take care. All right, then take care. Have a good one. All right. Y'all see it, man. All right, thanks. Nice CC. I like too, uh, appreciate it. Appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Let's get on in here. Let's get on in here, baby. Mr. Larry finna get something. I should have asked him what he finna get done. I'm finna ask him on his way out. Man, that be clean. Bro. It's so clean. Yes, sir. Y'all right, take care, Chief. All right, you too. Larry, One question: what, what you haven't done to your C6? I'm uh man on the uh, driver's side. Uh -huh. The seat shrunk down, so they gonna uh, build it back, build up, it back up. up. Yeah, build it back up. Spring them okay. went down. Okay, okay. okay. All, All right, right. Take care. All, All right, you too. You too now. Hey, right. what you want for it, man? <laughs> <laughs> what you want for he said, "What you talking about?" <laughs> <laughs> I'm still doing repairs, and he can do these old school okay. cars because he did them back in the day. He's been okay. that's all he's been doing is the all old right, school cool. cars. Any, any of the new stuff. Yeah, that ain't for, his this, generation. It's for the rain all uh, week, so you good. <laughs> yeah, <but> yeah. <laughs> I'm glad you get one, finally. Yes, sir. I know there's some people confused. They're like, yeah, man. man, I heard you put in. Yeah, yeah, we do one. I mean, every now and then I'll have an FX. Uh -huh. um, uh -huh. And sometimes a Maxima here and there. Right. But for the most part, it's it's Infinities. Wow. Man. It's like I almost answered the phone. Like, my glass is broken. I'm like, which Infinity is it? Yeah. That's, I mean, that's, 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 that's how it is, man. <laughs> uh, all right, all right buddy. All right, Appreciate man. you, man. Right. Y'all take care of All right. Thank you. Take care. All right. Thank you. Thank you. All right. <laughs> Uh, 
Every time you didn't love me. <laughs> that man said, bye, book. <laughs> I was talking to Mr. Larry. He said, he said, uh, he said, you got a card on you? I said, no, nah, I, I ain't got no flyers in, in the right. I was telling him about the car show. Okay. He said, oh, I like that truck too. Somebody got some money. I said, <laughs> yeah, I thought I said, the show ain't me. Hey, man. <laughs> juice grind, boy. <laughs> With that squat on there. Yes, sir. <laughs> Let's get it, man. 78 Chevy Boy. Gonna go drop towel, man, and go run my errands for the day. Y'all know me, I'll be running my errands on Monday, so we gotta get to that. Alright. Yeah, man. About to make another run. We're about to run up here to the uh to the uh, dealership. I kept Looking at the reviews on those uh, license plate brackets for the front on Amazon, it didn't have no good reviews at all, man. They said they were uh, they were brittle, they were hard. I mean, uh, cheap and brittle made, so you're gonna end up breaking it while you was installing it, man. I saw a lot of those, so I pay attention to them, them reviews a lot, man. So what I'm gonna do? I'm finna run up here to the dealership. They got it for like 21 bucks, so I'm finna go get the one from up there and install it on there, man. So I can put my plate on there, baby. Oh, I got to install that thing on there, man. Set me shave it, boy. Keep it locked, man. All right. Let's see. What do we have here? What do we have here? Looks like an interaction between two cars. Yep, I see her explaining now about they swerve. Let's see, is one a Mopar or Infinity? Let's see. We, ain't, we can't even see yet. Yep, Mopar. One on a Mopar. Good, we can get through on that line here, good. Oh, dang, that now little mama way over there by the school. Dang. It's a Mopar. Swivel when I be driving, man. Got to be. Man, they more messed up the gas prices up here or something. Why is so crunk up here? You know how it be when they mess up the gas prices and everybody call their partner and tell them? <laughs> oh, okay, they working over there. I was just about to say. Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. I'm gonna have to find that little that little clip and put it on my video so y'all can see what I be talking about when I say that, man. I said, hold up, wait a minute, something ain't right. Hello, big dog. Yeah, I forgot to tell y'all, you know my boy Jonas, man, he passed on that black. That black 250, and it's still up there too. It's still up there. He passed on it. He saw a couple little things wrong that he wanted. He wanted to get addressed. And, uh, I guess they not addressing it fast enough. Dude claimed they were gonna fix it, but uh, they ain't taking care of it fast enough, man. So he decided to pass on it. That's a lot of money we spending on these joints uh, for them not to be right. You know what I'm saying? What side I need to go on for parts? I don't have a sign up here. Oh, God. Damn. 
Looking for parts. Alright, it's probably on the other side. That's what it look like. I don't know, I ain't gonna get no driver in. Okay, it's a parts warehouse. Wow, I'm going the right way. It's a parts warehouse. for a second. Park right there for a second. We'll be right back, y'all. All right. Yeah, man, we back. Got he. And it just popping in, man. Got some little clips. Right here. They just... just you slide on the bottom of the bumper right here. And then these right here just pop in up top. They just pop in. Then you put your plate on, man. Like I got my drill and everything with me, boy. I said I was going to go down here with Marlin them shop it. I'm probably going to go down there and pop it on down there, man. We finna hook this right on up. When I went in there, I asked him about it. He like, yeah, I got it. $50 and something out the door. I'm like, hold on, hold on. And what my bro just said, he just called up there. He called up there uh, to the other dealership. They said it was 21 something. Okay, okay, let me see if I can work work the price, get it down for you. So I, by that time, I'm calling my bro. I'm calling my bro. And he was like, uh, he was like, yeah, they said 21 something, you straight. I was like, man, well, he said $50 here. Yeah. So. Trying to see, he like, hold on, hold on, let me see if I can get the price down for you. So he he ended up getting the price down. He said twenty one six nine out the door. I like, yeah. No man, try to get me for the thirty, man. He tried to get me for the thirty and put it in his pocket, man. I don't know, trying to get him some lunch. I don't know, some lunch and some squares, man. I think that's what he's trying to do. You feel me? I think that's what he was trying to do, dog. So uh, 
man. Y'all keep it locked, man. I was gonna go out to Jazz, but I ain't finna make that trip over there. I text them first, cause Jazz got some heat coming for Penny, man. Penny got some heat coming, dog. So tomorrow I'm gonna see if my day's slow at the shop tomorrow, and I'll jump over there and holler at them right now. I'm just gonna go down here and see what uh what Marlon them got going on. I know Marlon got through, man. He threw with that dunk, man. That dunk I posted that was in the air. Man, he that joint moving on his own power. So we finna go see if it's still down here and see what they got going on with that one then, man. Cause I don't wanna make that trip all the way out there to Jazz and he not there. He probably running some errands or something. Well just busy and couldn't answer the phone. But uh just know Penny got that heat coming, man. Keep it locked, man. Seven eight Chevy Boy. Get ready. 515-22, man. One of the biggest, baddest, best car shows to ever hit the mid south, man. And that's a promise. Alright. Yeah, man, about to go see what the guy got going on around here, Memphis Mike now. See old Brandon up here with the trailer. He must got that four-wheeler up here doing something. Probably got that four-wheeler up here. Migo with the clean Sierra, man. With the clean Sierra. Somebody burn that butane and everything. Little Migo brother with the clean... Uh, Gladiator. The gladiator. Get them guys over here. They looking. What up, what up? Trying to see what y'all going to do to it. Both of y'all just looking at it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Just two guys. Oh, for real? Yeah, this the one that needed everything. Needed everything. Yeah. 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 So we never took it down the street. Dang. How I do on the first run? Do I, did I? Yeah. Oh, okay. I just don't want to take too far thing. I don't break lights in the rain. Oh, okay, okay. Did yours? No. Oh, okay. Oh, there's juice. Who? Juice. Who was that? Photo push. Uh, oh, Sam Memphis. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what I know him by, South Memphis. Yeah, I knew that. Yeah. Oh, that one's up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it sure it was on that rack a long time, goddamn. Yeah. I see it, man. Getting it from the ruler to the tutor, man. Already got the swap. Now you on the suspension. Big brakes. Disc brakes all the way around. Coilovers. Rear end. Y'all see it. <clears throat> Y'all see it, man. Gonna be a nice. What year is it, uh, Terry? 69. Cuttings. Another one out of Memphis, man. I told you Memphis got them, them A bodies and them G bodies, man. Memphis got them, man. Memphis got them, dog. For real. You see it? Coilovers all the way around. Control arms. New everything, man. Ball joints, tie in rods, everything. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Y'all see over here, Devious Performance. Yes, sir. Got them Camaro, Camaro wheels on that joint. It already had exhaust ring. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, I see you were painted black, so I figured that. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, I don't see it, man. I'm like rocket right now. <laughs> 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 yeah, man. That ain't right coming down now, bro. I'll see it. We'll be back. Call it, man. Can't call it. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. They know it. Royal treatment. 
they know they, they know we'll get them right around here. We're gonna have them sitting up under there, like that right there. Yes, sir. We'll have them sitting up under there, man. New wheels, you gotta get the fitment right, man. You gotta get the get the uh, rear end shortened down. So you can sit on up under that thing, y'all see it though. You got plenty of space to go in. Okay. That's seven. Seven. With a seven. Okay, with a seven. What's up? G body. Told y'all, man. Step. Told y'all. Memphis about to be G body capital, man. Y'all can. You can get mad, you can say what you want, or you can. Chicago this, Chicago that. Chicago the box Chevy capital, man. Memphis about to be the, the, uh, the G body capital. I don't care what you say. We don't care what you say. Yeah. I don't, <laughs> I don't care what you say. Yeah, boy, he took that thing. He's gonna be right. Took it and squatted down. He gonna be good. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Get the big glass in that zone. With the big glass in it. See what's going on. What's up? Then we got the homie up here, Tin. Got him, got him tent in this thing, man. Yeah, the, the tent man. He about to, he about to lope, he about to lope the scat pack out. Man. He about to lope it out. What's up? There's some, I hear some rumbling. Me and uh, me and Big Zoo about to pull off, man. The homie just pulled up. The homie, <laughs> the homie just pulled up, man. He dropping the dropping the bunny off down here. A little work did to it, man. Money no cloud. Money no work did to it. Yeah, I'm about to head out though. So I'm gonna get to the house, man. Edit some of these videos for y'all. Just showing y'all what's going on, man. T. Davis towing. I don't know him, but I'll show y'all. Y'all might need a tow truck one day, man. T. Davis towing. The boy whipping that thing, too. The boy whipping that jump. So make sure the boy. Y'all keep it locked, man. Stay humble. Stay prayed up. Stay out the way, man. All right. 7 8 Chevy Boy presents the Connecting Never Competing Car Show. Going down in a major way, man. 515 22. Mark your calendars. We're going up. Everybody is invited, man. Low riders, old school, new school, lifted trucks, slingshots, motorcycles, it don't matter. It's a big reunion for the culture. Come on out, have a good time, pop your tent up. Sit back, relax, 
network, link up. That's what it's about, man. Connect and never competing. Get ready. Market calendars, 5 15 22. My seven, my seven, my seven. I'm dipping in my 